Hello from Slovenia again and welcome to Fiona's Art Lab again. Today I decided that I will play a little bit with Vallejo Fluid Acrylics. I have Vallejo Fluid Acrylic Cobalt, Turquoise, Phthalo, Phthalo C, Cyan Blue, Prussian Blue, Hansa Yellow and Black and White and this is not enough. I mixed a little bit of this satin poly, polymer, polymer varnish into my white for the base and my pouring medium, of course. And I will do a dip. Uh, I like to do dips, reverse dips. If you want to learn some of my techniques, Join me on PoorCon in Vegas this August. I will be first time in States teaching my techniques. Can't wait. We will have so much fun. There is 22 artists, so you can learn everything on one event. So poor con last Las Vegas this August 6th to 9th. If you didn't didn't book your tickets yet, still have time. Just spreading see some bugger or something. You are still there. Go out. Spreading paint. And now I will just add some drops of those fluid acrylics just randomly on this. Let's add some cobalt, turquoise, whoop! I think that some of them are thinner than others, I don't know, but I can already see that there will be some reaction out of this <gasps> white. Didn't mean to do that! Those blues looks the same, but they are not. And some yellow. I'm thinking if I want to add some magenta to, I don't know, no, or maybe, let's add a little bit of magenta for some, I don't know, effects, not effects, or some color <clears throat> and I will add some black too and some titanium white in fluid acrylics this is a good idea but if you don't try you don't know okie doke and now I will just dip my canvas into this down and now I will I don't want to press hard hard I don't want to smash the paint the whole lot underneath 
just want to make sure that this is covered and I will go from corner to corner with lifting it wow 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 so beautiful this part here is not it is covered but but the lacing it's just beautiful wow love it I wonder if this is from the fluid acrylics or from uh, this varnish mixed in to the white. Let me torch real quick and I will torch this too. Interesting effects. Really interesting. And I will leave this skin to dry too and use it for some jewelry or something because it's some beautiful stuff here. You can always dip. We can try that too. Let's dip another one. So this is the first one. See some cool reactions. I love them. And this is the Second one that has some more colors on it and some mixing of colors. Maybe I shouldn't have had black. I thought that it will maybe help with creating some cells and I don't like this yellow. <laughs> part here but I wonder how this will dry and here is my plastic that it will be used for some skins for jewelry or something because some parts are really interesting so cool but the first one is definitely my favorite <coughs> so stay tuned for the dry results so here is the dry 
painting the dried really interesting it looks like that there are some cracks but they are not so I will definitely I ordered some golden fluids too so I will try with those two this is the second one that we redipped but the skin is looking that it's cracked but I don't know maybe I can still use this for something because some parts are really cool interesting I will definitely play with those fluids maybe not complicate with the base and see what will happen but definitely I will do some dips just with fluid acrylics from the bottle not mixed with pouring medium see what will happen uh, thanks for watching and see you on the next one bye